What is going on, everyone? Welcome back to another brand new episode of Madden Subscriber League. We are in the wild card now. We are still in the wild card. Last episode, if we look at this schedule, the ba the Pittsburgh Steelers beat the Baltimore Ravens. A subscriber team did, but the Detroit Lions beat it. Um, the Detroit Lions, a subscriber team, lost to a non-subscriber team. Very sad, but. We actually, no, let me look at the teams we're taking a look at today. We are taking a look at the Jacksonville Jaguars versus the Miami Dolphins, which we're recording right now, and then the Carolina Panthers, New Orleans Saints. So it's none of, so it's all non subscriber for subscriber teams. All of them are non subscriber for subscriber matchups. So, but whoever wins this one, it's a number three seed versus number six seed, which is Jacksonville versus Miami. Battle of Florida. So, whoever wins this will face on Chain Chomp's Tennessee Titans. And I just realized that whoever won this one would face on against Nicholas Rizon, aka the Raiders. And since the Steelers won, they're facing the Oakland Raiders, which if you don't know, they're, they're, rival they're huge rivals. Well, not really huge anymore, but they were, but it was really huge in like the seventies and stuff. All right, but today we're gonna take a look at the team. We all see the Dolphins; they're the worst team in the playoffs. If we're talking about statistics, the NFC, the worst team is like you know the Bucks nine six and one, but the worst team in this is a uh, nine and seven Dolphins. If we look at the AFC East. They barely clinched it. If they would have lost, the Bills probably would have clinched it. But right now, it we have to we have to show off the subscribers on who's playing. Eighty, there's teams that straight or eighty five overall. So now it's Harry Potter. You know she joined in this league kind of late, but you know he has been balling out. He's the reason why the Dolphins made the playoffs. 70, he's a 75 overall, about his feet is 76. He's from Hogwarts. And, you know, he, he's been popping off. Let me look at his stats for this year. His stats for this year were pretty good. 3,600 yards, two, six, 30, 30 touchdowns, and 12 interceptions. That's pretty good for Harry Potter. And now for Eli Monk, the second subscriber. Here, here he is. Number one. Number one. It's the number one wide receiver in the whole league. Number 92, Eli Monk. I can name like a couple other people that are like higher than him. But you know, he is one of the, he is one of the highest rated overall people in Madden Subscriber League. He got a 92. And guess what? He was the number one overall pick in the Season 1 NFL Draft. If we look at his stats for this year, last year, you know, he was kind of doing pretty good. But this year, he almost has almost 1,000 receiving yards and 13 touchdowns. That's more than triple than what he had last year. By the way, since he's the no we're gonna make him the number one wide receiver because Harry Potter needs someone to throw to, right? Oh yeah, you know I'm right. Anyway, let's get into this highly anticipated matchup right here. All right, and we back. Now here it is. It's the most anti It's a pretty anticipated matchup. I've been anticipating it. The Jacksonville Jaguars. Versus the Miami Dolphins. The Battle of Florida. Battle between the North and the South. I've been to Jacksonville before. It was, it's alright. Right. I mean, I drew, the most I've been through is just drove through it. Fun fact, we are live. We are live in the Miami Dolphins Stadium. That doesn't sound like a big deal at all. But, but in one of the news, it says that this, that after this year, they're getting, the Miami Dolphins are getting a brand new stadium. So this stadium that's been around since like the goddamn 80s. Is about to be taken down and it's up for a new stadium. But hey, before it gets taken down, at least they can witness the freaking playoffs. Alright, here they go. Oh, they're running this off. Unfortunately, I would not like to see them run it off because if they did, we just came here for the strivers, not you know what. Oh, he almost dropped that botched punt or whatever it's fucking called. It was not botched, but you know what I mean. Alright. Oh, fourth and second already? Come on. 
Alright, unless this punt is really good. No, it's not. Alright. Oh, oh damn. Oh yeah, the Jacksonville Jaguars quarterback is Deshaun Watson. Oh shit, I'm scared. Yo, can we exit out? Can we exit this out? Deshaun Watson's not on our team. Our, we have to focus on Harry Potter. Now, Deshaun Watson, he's pretty cool. But, it's... But, you know. Jacksonville Jaguars, in this season... In this, you know, universe. They won the Super Bowl in Season 1. But, in real life, the la Like, they made the conference championship in 2018. But, after that, they just kind of been ass. Like, literally. I think I think this year... I, I think I heard plans this year that they're actually starting to tank. Which, if you don't know what tanking means, it means uh, you, you, you purposely suck to get a draft pick. That's probably what the Cardinals did this season. <laughs> oh, they're running this again! Oh, damn. Just me. Season 3 draft is going to be the craziest thing of all time. Like, dead ass. Harry Potter finally gets his first possession of the game and he throws it in. Is that a Monk? I think that is Monk. I don't know what Monk's number is. Oh, throws, passes it off. Oh, what are you, what the hell? Why are you going backwards? No, that's Hill. I think Monk's 85. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, Harry Potter! Harry Potter throws it in and he passes, throws it in! Let's effing go! Yeah, there's Monk, number 85 over there. Damn. They keep running the ball, so I just wanted to, I just want them to pass it deep to Monk. Now just a reminder, whoever wins this will face on you know the Tennessee Titans, aka Chain Chomp Fan and Dodeca Coco Mecca. Oh, brace off the tackle. Let's go. Harry Potter three and three. Harry Potter, he's doing yeah. I already said this, but he did pretty good this season. It's just a matter of who's actually going to win. Oh, oh, damn. Oh, Harry Potter. Oh, deflected. Who was that? That was even to Monk. No way. If he would have caught that, that would have been a certified touchdown. No cap. Now, Harry Potter is, of course, just standing there doing nothing. Oh, oh, curl route. And that was to Monk. Look at Monk. What an inspiration. That's why he was the number one draft pick in 20. That was the reason why he's the number one draft pick in 20. In, in the season one draft. As they get the first down. Let's effing go. The Dolphins could win this. They could not win this. It's all a matter of when. But the real question is. Can the Miami Dolphins beat the defending Super Bowl champions. The Jacksonville Jaguars. Well we'll find out right here right now. Oh, and he throws it in for a touchdown, Dolphins. Let's effing go. That was not Monk, but, you know, Harry Potter needs all these touchdowns. Let's effing go. Look at that replay. Boom. They were doing nothing. Sure, let's watch the kick. Why not? Let, even though he's going to get it in. Boom. Kicks that shit in. Alright. Next up. You just got to see the Jacksonville do it. You know what? Let's... Oh, yeah. Good thing I didn't watch that shit. That shit would have been boring. <laughs> All right. I feel like Jacksonville is actually going to score on this drive. I'm kind of scared. Yeah, they did. I'm going to just... Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared, guys. I'm actually scared. Here they go. They have the ball. And Harry Potter. Oh, throws it in. 
Oh damn. Harry Potter. I think the reason why he's doing good is the team around him. Damn. Here they go. Oh, and he, pat and he catches it in again. Look at Harry Potter. He can clutch it up. Unlike Go to Fight Kev, he can actually clutch it up. Now, this game could get very intense at any minute. Jacksonville Jaguars, they're pretty notorious for the defense back in 2017. Except this ain't 2017 anymore. As oh! And with the touchdown! Dolphins, let's go! That was to Hill. That's not Monk, but Harry Potter throwing in all the touchdowns they can get. Let's see that replay. Oh! Catches that like it's nothing. No, no. Actually, no. Fast. The fuck? Oh, shit. Oh, damn. I want to I wanna change possession. Jacksonville. Oh! They missed the 32-yard field goal. You garbage at your poverty organization. Oh, my God. Just kneel that shit. Oh, wait. They have another chance. Oh, shit. Oh, they actually made the field goal this time. That's... That's uh, all right. All right. I want to I want to all right. I'm going to jump play. I'm going to see how how well they do. Yeah, good thing I didn't watch that. That would have been boring as shit. Oh shit. Oh, oh what the fuck? Oh damn. All right. I'm just doing change of possession just so it could be and they get the lead. That's ho that's that's horrifying. All right. They get they 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 got the run multiple times. Let's go. Let's effing go. All right. Change of possession. Oh, 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 wait, oh, oh, wait, fumble, oh, shit, the Jaguars, oh, God, wait, oh, my God, he's going to return this for a touchdown, holy shit, yo, Jacksonville, with the touchdown, earlier I said they were not notorious for, the, they were notorious for the defense back in 2017, Look at this defense. They picked that. They stripped him up and returned that shit for a touchdown. Damn. The Dolphins. Oh, my God. The Dolphins. I am sorry. Oh, third quarter. Oh, shit. Oh, boy. Oh, God. You, if he would have broke off that tackle, actually, and kept onto the ball, that could have been returned for That could have been a touchdown, honestly. Like, dead ass. Ah, shit, my internet's probably went out the moment I'm recording this. Oh, and, oh, boom. Look at him go. And their wide receiver's out. Thank God it was a monk, though. If it was, that would have been bad. Harry Potter, he's trying to prove, he's just trying to come back. He's just trying to be like, that fumble never happened. I'm going to score so much that we're going to make sure that fumble actually never happened. And he throws the touchdown. Who was it to? It's to Monk TV. Let's effing go. Monk TV showing up. And trying to make sure their team wins the freaking game. Let's see that replay. Boom, clutch catch right there from Mr. Monk TV. Let's effing go. That's what I'm talking about. Good. If you went from the two-point version, that would have been bad. Oh, like, straight up. Oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. I'm scared. Oh, boy. Oh, they, come on, Dolphins. Let's go, Dolphins. Come on, don't get sacked if you do. What the fuck? Why didn't you catch that? Don't get sacked if he does. That's probably a safety. As they punted the ball really good. As you can see, they're on their own nine. That's that's horrendous. That's hor horrifying. What the fuck? Harry Potter, you were you went from the most clutch man alive to just literally overthrowing everyone. What the fuck? This I bet you it's gonna be a fourth down. And they're gonna be forced to punt, right? Yep. Yep, the, yep, mm -hmm. yep, 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 yep. Damn. Fourth and eight. He passed it for two yards. This is... Damn. Ah, oh, damn, if you didn't do that, that would have been... Yeah, yep, this is a touchdown. Second ten. You better be throwing that. You better be chugging that shit. Woo, 
thing how you did. Oh, that was even to Eli Monk. And Monk is injured on the plate. You fucking serious. This better be like. Yo, this better be like a fucking. That better be like. At least like a cramp or some shit. Because if Monk is really out for the playoffs, that's sad. But hey, at least he did score a touchdown. He throws it. But why short pass? You literally can't afford to do that. Damn, two minute warning. That's horrifying. Damn. Come on. Reza. Oh my god. Yo. Fucking. Why is Harry Potter. Harry Potter. When I said. Actually, why, why am I calling him the Clutch Man? He literally blew a 17 3 lead against the freaking Steelers uh, with a backup QB. Oh shit. Who is that on? Oh, we do have a flag oh, down. Offense. Let's check in with our. That was a fucking holding. Come on, yo! This is getting sad. Oh, they—they're just gonna kick the field goal. Wait, why are you kicking a field goal? Can you even do that? You're a poverty franchise. You—you're done. Fuck you. Sorry, sorry for being so negative, but it's like, god fucking damn. Just, just win. Just win. You won. You won. You won. Yep, you won. <sighs> God damn it. I mean, they are defending Super Bowl champions. I don't know what to say. But damn, I expected them to do better. Like, Harry Potter, he's not a clutch man. He, he blew a 17-3 lead to Lance Benser. And then he and then he fucking... In the first three quarters, he was literally playing like he was Patrick Mahomes. But... But in the fourth quarter, he was playing like he was goddamn turmoil. Let's look at the stats, shall we? Alright. Harry Potter threw for 226 yards, three touchdowns, but zero interceptions. Deshaun Watson zero, threw zero touchdowns, yet they still managed to win. What a poverty ass franchise. Wouldn't that have happened if they didn't fumble that ball? This is this guy's fault. Actually, no. It's Marcus Redmond's fault. He fumbled the ball away, which made them return it to a touchdown. If that didn't happen, the, this game would have been a close one. But still, Eli Monk with the touchdown. Let's go, Eli Monk with one touchdown and 40 yards. But, unfortunately, the Dolphins are out. But, hey, let's go to the next game, shall we? Alright, and now we're at the Saints' side. We're going to show off what the Saints have. Alright, they they just barely clinched the division, but they have to go on against their divisional rivals, the Carolina Panthers, who have no one. But, but here, but, but look at this. We gotta show off their quarter. We gotta show off the roster. Blaze, alright, Blaze. I don't know why I keep saying hidden. I don't know why, but Blaze, you know, she, I mean, like, oh, <laughs> I forgot what I was gonna say. Blaze, you know, she he came into this league pretty late, but, but you know. He, he's still balling out, 3,200 yards, 23 touchdowns, and 8 interceptions. That's, hmm, that's pretty decent. Then we got the highest, then we got the reason, then we got the face of the team. Sal freaking Volcano. Sal Volcano, running back 92 overall. He is, he and Monk are the highest rated people in this whole thing. Like, last year, he didn't really do much because he kept getting injured literally every game. But since Salvacano actually took some time and decided to not get injured every single time, he ran for 1,000 yards and 8 touchdowns. And he only fumbled the ball once. So that's 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 fun. But the real question is, if Salvacano could not get injured during this game, could he clutch, could he clutch up the playoffs? I mean, could he clutch it up? I mean, yeah. But Blaze, though, she doesn't really have any good weapons. Their highest overall player is an 83. So if the Saints do... Lose? Could they use that pick to gain like someone very special, like, like Blaze? Like she's she doesn't really have any good targets besides an 83 overall receiver. But Salvacano, that's where he comes in to carry the team. So let's get straight into it. All right, now we back. This time, it's the these two hate each other very much because they're divisional rivals. The Carolina Panthers with the New Orleans Saints. Both of these are pretty good teams, you know. The Saints, they're really good IRL, but the Panthers, 
They made they went fifteen and one and and made the Super Bowl in twenty fifteen, but lost Super Bowl ever that ever since that they haven't recovered since. But here comes the New Orleans Saints. Look at them go, man! Remember the face of the team is Sal Vulcano, but but the, we also got to pay attention to the freaking Blaze. They are gonna return this, but you know. All right, and how will this do? All right, slow. And now let's watch the first drive. And now it's out. And now my voice is literally about to go out because I have that feeling. Oh, Salvacano! Oh shit, Salvacano! Number twenty-two. Keep that in mind. God, we already have like one out of the three p games we recorded for the subscribers. Only one win. Oh, oh, Blaze throws a dot. Oh, oh, flag who's it on? Smashed. Certainly looked like it indeed. Here come the flags. Defense. That was on the defense. So now the Saints are gonna accept that. This time. Come on, Saints. We need you to do this. Out of the, all the games we recorded for the three we recorded three subscriber teams, and only one actually made it to the next round. And what I mean by Salvacano can clutch it up. When he's not injured, this is what I actually meant. Second and inches. Oh shit. Oh, Sal Lucano. Oh, breaking off every tackle. Oh shit. Look at Sal, man. He can clutch. He's the clutch man. Now, whoever wins this will face on against. Shit, who is it? I forgot. But I do know that they. But I do know one of the teams they have to face is the Skyrim team. I think. We got the 49ers. Who, who else? Oh, and he throws a dot. Let's go, Blaze. Oh yeah, I remember now. Whoever wins this will face on Cyclops Redskins. Come on. They keep running this in with Sal because they know Sal can clutch it up, right? Most likely. Yes, yes, yes. They will. They will. I, I can sense it. As they throw in a touchdown, Saints. Let's go, Blaze. Let's go, Blaze. They can clutch it up. Let's effing go. Now, oh shit, the Panthers might actually catch up. They will get a field goal though. I'm gonna simulate for one drive. I'm gonna, si I'm gonna, alright, they got the first. Actually, should I? Yeah. Alright, good thing I didn't, because if I did, that would have been boring. Alright, change possession. Carolina Panthers probably could score in that touchdown. Yep, they will. Alright, how about... Alright, there we go. That's that's perfectly enough time. Alright, let's do this. Alright, they're in kind of field goal range. They could cl clutch it up. Oh, 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 Sal! No, he ran into the people. Damn. It is almost... It is almost the second half. And, t and Sal already ran for 50 yards. That's pretty good for Sal. Oh, Blaze. Oh, catches it. Oh, let's go. Alright, let's go. Come on. Oh shoot, they only got a minute left. They really need to chuck this, in my opinion. Well, that's in my opinion. Oh, oh, yeah, throw that out. He was about to get sacked. I can understand why. My voice is literally about to go out. Oh my god. That means no more Madden subscriber league, guys. I'm, I'm joking. Oh, and he catches that. Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh, let's go! Oh, they're gonna check that down. Oh, oh, they couldn't, he couldn't exactly catch that. They aren't running the same with Volcano because they, they can trust Blaze. Right? Right? Right, guys? <laughs> Sal. Oh, Blaze with the touchdown. Let's go. That's that's what I'm talking about. The Saints, they can clutch it. Oh, and that's an interception by... Oh, I thought that said Nick, and then his last name was Gurr. I was about to say, Madden's weird. Nick Gunn. Let's go, Nick. Oh, oh, Blaze! Oh, oh! Let's go, Blaze! What's funny is that they have a, they actually have another chance to score a touchdown. Because why not? Oh, checking that down. Oh. All right, I don't, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Oh wait, Bla Blaze, you have enough time to scramble. Oh, right. that's almost in. That's almost in. Do that the one yard? Just run this in with Sal. Run this in with Sal. That's literally all you need to do. Come on. Common knowledge. Just run this in with Sal because he can actually clutch. And that's a touchdown, Blaze. Touchdown, Saints. Let's go. The Saints, they're just blowing out their division rivals, the Carolina Panthers. Oh, damn. All right. Oh, shoot. I, oh, shoot. I should actually, like, you know. <laughs> Come on. Oh, oh, Sal Bucano. Oh, Sal. Sal. I, is he about to play a full game? The moment I say that, he's going to get injured. <laughs> uh, bro, my bulk lords are literally going to go out. I'm about to die. But, you know, I care about y'all. So, might as well, you know. Oh, I thought that was completed. <laughs> I don't know why I was signing right there. Probably because I'm resting on my voice. Blaze, they're having the ball. Oh, almost an interception. Blaze not having a perfect game right now. Throwing three touchdowns. Blaze, they're going to run the same with Sal. Sal Volcano. Oh, I couldn't get it in time. They're gonna kick a field goal or some shit. They're gonna kick a field goal. Why not? Boom! Kicks it in. Bam! All right, they're above by eight points. Panthers need a touchdown and a two-point conversion to actually, you know, take the lead. So, all right, I feel like they can clutch, right? I feel like the, I feel like the can they touch that? Oh, they actually got the two point conversion. Oh shit, that's scary. Now this is where shit gets real. Are the, are the Saints actually gonna blow the lead? Holy shit, that'd be that'd be terrifying for the Saints. Oh what the fuck? I know the Saints are kind of known for blowing the leads. For example, one time. They did like a pitch play, like a t like a pitch play. I forgot what it's called, and like against the Jaguars in a 2003 game, all they needed to do was kick in the extra point to tie it up to go to overtime, and the kicker missed. All that just for a just for a missed kick. That would have been 
Ooh. So hopefully this same doesn't apply to Blaze. And he throws a dot wide open, man. Down the field. Let's effing go, my man. Just Blaze. Just, just don't mess this up. So, so, so you, Sal. Don't, don't f this up. They're throwing a play, and there he goes. Blaze. Oh, passes it off. Oh. If they don't score a touchdown on this drive, they can always get a field goal. Just saying. Oh, Sal! Sal with the Sal can clutch it in for the first. Almost a hundred yards on the on the game for him. Blaze just standing there, throwing away. He's getting com uncomfortable out there. All right, they're going to run this in with Sal. Sal Vulcano, oh, gets caught up. But at least he gets the first. And with the two-minute warning. Just run this in with Sal, in my opinion. Run this. Oh, I feel like they're in the blitz formation. That's. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, drops it. But who's the flag on? down in the backfield Offense. let's get the oh, that was all holding you dead ass come on they're gonna run this in with Sal once again Sal Volcano touchdown Saints touchdown Volcano let's go 30 to 30 to 24 let's fucking go let's see them kick in this extra point boom kicks it in and bam just like that they're now a touchdown ahead all right now end the game oh boy we're in overtime we're in overtime. Ah, oh, shit. Guys, we're in overtime. Saints, the Panthers, they man, I thought I was silent because I was simulating till the end. But, here they go. Alright. Alright. Alright, I'm scared. Alright, I'm scared. Don't fuck this up, Madden. Thank you. If you would have done that, I would have been fucking pissed off. Stop, stop the play, stop the play. Oh shit, he's running. Second and one. The Saints need to do is stop this. If the Panthers, remember, here's, all right, there is no, you, all right, you cannot, this game cannot end in a tie. And, oh, he gets sacked. Maybe that's where Jerry the G needs to go. His favorite team is the Saints. Because I saw in his NFL playoff prediction videos, he was wearing a Saints jersey. So... Maybe, maybe the Saints could get Jared G. Nah, Jared G is probably one of the best players in the draft, so probably can't get him. Unless the Saints trade up for the number one. In case, unless the Saints want to trade up. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Oh, damn. Oh, and they stop him. Let's go, Saints. Let's fucking go. That's what I'm talking about, my man. Fucking go. They have no choice. They have no choice. They have to punt it. They have to. Punts it like it was nothing. Oh. Oh, they could have blocked shit. Oh. They could have blocked. Actually, no, we need to. Don't fuck this up, Madden. Woo! I thought it fucked up for a moment. I was about to say. When Madden fucks up, I, that just loses my morale. It makes me just don't want to record for a bit. But here I go, Sal Vulcano, oh, breaking off, trying to find all the holes he can fucking run through. 
trying to find in all the open spots. Which is the first. So the Carolina Panthers, they wasted their drive. So here's so here's how it works. If the Saints get a touchdown while well, it's game over. But if they also get a field goal right now. Oh shit, huge run by Sal. But if the Saints get a field goal right here, then they win the game. Remember, whoever wins can fa will face on against Psycho Imp in the divisionals. But the real question is, will, will we win? Will, will the Saints win? Because if this ends in a tie, that's unfortunate. There has been... Oh, he catches it. I thought that was going to be picked off. If that was NCAA 14, that probably would have been picked off. Eh? <laughs> uh. Blaze, 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 blaze. What the fuck? Come on. Let's get in field goal range. You're already in you're already in field goal range, but I recommend getting that 30 yard line just to kick it in. That would have been that would be fun. Knee. South Oh Blaze throws in a throws in a dot. Over this is an overtime thriller we're seeing right here. Oh, oh, he, he throws like, I guess a check down. Oh, Sal, Sal, oh shit, he, why are you running backwards? I guess Sal got scared. He already ran for 120 yards. Sal, 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 throws it deep. Nope, never mind. Why am I seeing Sal? Blaze throws it deep. This is it, the field goal. Will they win? Oh, they're freezing the kick. That's That makes it even more intense. Come on, will the Saints win? All this, their playoff dreams relies on this kick. Will they kick it in? And the kick is good. The New Orleans Saints take the dub. Let's go. Let's Justin Tucker. I think, believe that's his name. Kicks it in to clutch it in overtime. Let's fucking go. And that's the game. That's going to conclude the game. Let's go. The Saints will face on Cyclone, a.k.a. the Redskins and the Divisionals. That it that's that's fucking insane. Like dead ass. <laughs> Here it is. Oh boy. Well they had more rushing yards, but the Panthers they do have more passing yards. That's fucking insane. The now the Saints they move on to the divisionals. Now the now Blaze. 241 yards, 3 touchdowns, 0 interceptions. And 2! And Sal... <coughs> Damn, I got Corona. And Sal Vicano, 200, 220 yards and 1 touchdown. What the fuck? So yeah. Saint, so, there we go. The New Orleans Saints, they, t they, barely, they barely clinch it up. They barely clutch it up. But now... We have to see what's happening in the divisionals. Thank you all so much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, and stay tuned to see the divisionals. And bye bye.